Hey, that was my dude, though. Hey, he ended, he ended up, uh, real. He ended up being on our side by the time. Though. First, he went to kill us, and then, then he was our friend, you know what I mean? That was, that was a good day right there. So, right, that's why so sometimes people want to fight you and stuff, man. Don't feed into that negative energy. Just keep getting on the truth, man. Because you, you might win them. You know what I mean? Philippians 2 and, uh, where was I at? Philippians 2 and 9. Wherefore the Most High also hath exalted him, speaking of Yahweh Shah, the one they call Jesus. Wherefore God also hath highly exalted him and given him a name which is above every name, that at the name of Yahweh Shah every knee should bow of things in heaven and things in the earth and things under the earth. Boy, that's deep, right? That things under the earth? What's under the earth? <laughs> That's a whole nother. That's a that, that's for the uh, conspiracy show. We going that's for the Bible mystery show. The Leviathan. Yeah, the Leviathan. Okay, the Bible. Yeah, the Bible speaks about. Oh, you see that new Godzilla anime coming out? Yeah. That looks nice. Yeah, the Godzilla anime coming out. But yeah, the, you know Godzilla is based on uh, the Leviathan in the, found in the Bible. You know, that's where they get the idea of uh, dinosaurs. You know what I'm saying? There was never, they never called anything a dinosaur until the 1800s. Before the 1800s, they called dinosaurs behemoths and leviathans and dragons. There was actual dragons. They were actual breed fire. That's not mythology. That was actually a real thing. But now they're going to call them, what are they going to call it? That's a brontosaurus. That's a, a T-Rex. You know what I mean? That's a, that's a made up name. That's a Leviathan and Behemoth and a dragon. Greek names. You just caught up the original names. So oh, yeah. Greek. Well, dinosaur is Greek because Soros in Greek means lizard. Like George Soros. The so called Jew, he's a lizard. But, uh, yeah, actually, the word Leviathan, that's a Hebrew word. And the word Behemoth is a Hebrew word. And we still use those words in English today. You know what I mean? But people don't know because that's proof of our Hebrew heritage is we all still use the Hebrew language every day and don't even know it. Every time you say hallelujah, you're giving praise unto Yahweh, Yah. That's the God of the Bible. And that's a he hallelujah is a Hebrew word. Every time you say hallelujah, you're giving praises to the most high God of the Bible. Okay? The word amen, that's a Hebrew word. It means uh, so be it, truthfully. Okay? <laughs> You got some? Oh, uh, that, 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 I can read this last one right here. Oh, this is good though. This goes right with the spirit. Wherefore, my beloved, have ye have always obeyed, not as in my presence only, but now much more in my absence, work out your own salvation with fear and trembling. You know, like people always say, you believe what you want, I believe what I want. Yeah, believe what you want. If you don't believe us, we, we don't care. Just go believe what you want. If you believe that the Most High is not what we said, you don't got to believe us. You know what I mean? It says, For it is the Most High which worketh in you both to will and to do of his good pleasure. <laughs> Here goes one right here. To all things without murmurings and disputings, that you may be blameless and harmless, the sons of the Most High, with that rebuke in the midst of a crooked and perverse nation <laughs> among, whom, among whom ye shine as lights in the world, holding forth the word of life that I may rejoice in the day of Yahweh Shai, that I have not run in vain, neither labored in vain. So what we doing out here is not in vain. You know what I mean? We, we come out here, you will put ourselves at risk. People want to kill us. They want to beat the shit out of us. We got brothers that have people throw piss on them before. Get that shit thrown on them. You know, they still gonna come out here and do the work. Yeah, they throw to tobacco uh, spit at you. We had people throw a brick of firecrackers at us once. Yeah, you had people pull out knives and guns on us. Uh, we were in that crackhead trying to fight. Yeah, you still see us doing the work. Well, we still doing the work. Okay. We, we pray to the Lord, He give it that spirit of fearlessness. You know what I mean? Because the scriptures say you got to be bold as a lion. You can't, you can't be afraid to come out here in the midst of these people, man. 
even though they come out, they, they threaten to beat us up. That's the cause of that right here. Right. The stress, you can't, you know you gotta hold back, right? My beard gonna be it's fully gray soon. You. It's that stress, man. I can't wait to get that full gray beard. Man, I'll be looking like stress. I'll be looking like Jump. Moses and Aaron. That day gonna come when the leashes is gonna be loose. They go that most high gonna take the leash off that line. Whew. You know? Oh yeah, well, they ain't ready for that one. 16 and 16, you know? That day gonna come when the Lord is gonna take the leash off. Hey, let's get it. I'm gonna let me read it. You know what I'm saying? Because this fishing right now, we just chill, we we humble fishing. Humble fishing. And if that one lady, she would if she would calm down. I mean, we was, if she would shut the hell up, she agreed with more than she even knew. They come, then we over and hit it, and then, and then kill her. <laughs> and kill her. She said, why are we not exposing the police? It's like, mind explodes. have no understanding. <sighs> it's like, oh my God, bro. have no understanding. Man. I mean, what the fuck you think we've been doing out here for the past 10 years? Right. Singing, um, singing um, Negro spiritual. <laughs> We've been out here condemning these devils for a decade straight, bro. She gonna talk about well, where you at cussing these devils at. <laughs> what? Huh? Like, what's that? What, what's my name? You know what I'm saying? There you go. Before you read that up, right. please <laughs> ask 11 and 7. Blame not before thou hast examined the truth. Understand first and then a rebuke. <laughs> right. They want to rebuke us before they even hear what we say. You know what I mean? You're automatically. I don't like the way you look. They was going crazy just from the way we were speaking, man. Yeah, it was a fulfillment of prophecy right, right. there. That's what it was. Answer not before thou hast heard the cause. Neither interrupt me in the midst of the time. Yeah, they didn't interrupt. They weren't even listening, man. That's I'm being unreasonable. Right. Answer not before thou hast heard the cause. Neither interrupt me in the midst of the time. Yeah, they didn't interrupt. They weren't even listening, man. That's I'm being unreasonable. And they got one. They had like, they was like a one trick pony. You know what I mean? Oh. That's why your garment, that's why your shirt look like a potato sack. Well, don't you know the word sack? Well, that's the spirit, don't you know? Well, her thighs were brought it out. Yeah, right, right. But, uh, right. but you know the word sack, they said potato sack. The word sack, actually, like a potato sack, is actually a Hebrew word. The word sack, like, you know, a sack, you put your groceries in a sack. The word sack is a Hebrew word. It's actually pronounced shock. And, and uh, the prophets of the Old Testament would all put on sack cloth. That's all through the Bible. They, they will cut their hair, they pour ashes on their head, and wear a sack cloth. You know what I mean? So that's why we wear the garments that we wear, because we're a mourning. This, this is a, 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 a metaphor, you know what I mean? For when we are mourning. That's why we wear them bummy garments, you know what I mean? When we are mourning. We out here, we out here, right. You know what I mean? Got, uh, so go ahead, go ahead. I was just saying that's why we out here signing and crying for all these abominations done out here. You know what I mean? We the only ones out here in Columbus out here uh, cursing out these devils, exposing the government, cursing out the cops. You know what I mean? I ain't seen nobody else out here, bro. Cursing out these wicked niggas. Ecclesiastes yeah, twenty and seven. A wise man will hold his tongue till he see an opportunity, but a babbler and a fool. Will regard no time. It's yep. constantly funny. You know, blah, 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 blah. Hey, you had a spirit of a woman over there. The spirit of a woman. I, that dude looks familiar. I know him from somewhere. Who? Oh, he cause he's always out here. Nah, I seen him. I know him from somewhere, for real. Like, he just looks so familiar. Oh, you probably saw him, saw him get eaten up by a lion in the past. Yeah, what's that thing? <laughs> he, caused, he was selling book tickets. Probably right? one of them ignorant ass children that uh, Isaiah called the, uh, the she bears on. She bears, you know. I do know him though. I seen him somewhere. Hey man, these these niggas think they're so tough, but they come out so ready to fight people with Bibles. How tough are you, dude? You know what I'm saying? We got Bibles on our hands. You you really want to come? Up. Oh, what's up? What's up? You're real tough, bro. You're real tough. That's a good. I never thought about it that way. Cause I thought, you know, what I'm saying like, look around, look around. I thought we were like some some bad guys. Right. We ain't out here packing heat. Hey, they rolled up a Peraza like that. Peraza, uh, he should lock him up. Hey, he'll uh, he, uh, bust cast on him. Sure will. You know what I mean? Sure will. Well, they jump them anyway. Yeah, they go to, they go to Camp Strax. Yeah. Sure we ain't they coming out here, Strax. They even the same. Yep. I hope up. I hope it's Slow, too. Slow. I know two hours and now he's gone. Because this is a video of this dumbass Jake jumped in a 
through the mud to show how he can get out of quicksand. And he slowly, the video is seven minutes long, and he slowly went down and died, man. Really? They I talk slowly. That, that's, that's some of the worst stuff we've seen in a minute, bro. Well, they, they got, uh, that, that's a I, that's well, bad the for them. The Lord is still out here. Still out here and they gone. That's right. We're still here and they, where they at? That's right. That's a good point. That's right. We're here, they're not in the story. That's and, and, I, and really, man, well, I really feel bad for them because, whoo wee. It's going to get bad for them, man. They're going to understand all everything. Oh, and man. then your boy with leprosy came up and turned Judas on us. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He man. went straight Judas. Oh, they turned straight to a Judas, didn't they? Man, yeah. bro. Yeah. 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 Sure did. Yeah. Yeah. He fought. The scriptures say follow not a multitude. Yeah, he was cool at first. He part. was cool. Yeah. Yeah. Now he's a Judas. He just marked man. Yeah. Yeah. All of them are Most high, bro, ain't nothing to be played with, pal. I'm telling you. Uh -huh. hey, hey, hey. Good morning. Oh. Just like they could, even if they, somebody did kill us and beat the shit out of us or something. You know what I mean? That would be even worse for them. Because what the scripture say they think they do the service and they kill you when they try to Oh, I got that with the Lord when they called him. Oh, you do? Matthew 27, I'm starting to love it. How shall I stood before the governor? And the governor asked him, saying, Are thou the king of the Jews? And how shall I said unto thee, Thou sayest. And when he was accused of the chief priest, in other words, he answered nothing. Then said Pilate unto him, Hearest thou not? How many things thy witness against me? And he answered him to never a word, insomuch that the governor marveled greatly. Now at that feast, the governor was wont to release unto the people a prisoner whom they would. And they had then a noble prisoner called Barabbas. Therefore, when they were gathered together, Pilate said unto them, Whom will ye that I release unto you? Barabbas or Yahweh Shai, which is called the anointed. For he knew that for envy they had delivered him. As if Israel envied you, always jealous of him. They didn't want to kill it. Look, you, we had a state trooper right here. Mm -hmm. There was a highway patrol man right there, and they was coming up against me. She was complaining about cops the whole time. There was a perfect opportunity right to go there. curse out the devil, yeah. and she didn't do it. You know what I mean? Because yeah. these people are full of shit. Oh, she said, well, fuck the police. That she, was it. She didn't say nothing to him, bro. Right. She didn't get him right. call his face, call him a devil or nothing. Right. They ain't saying nothing about the injustice they're doing. Right, and, and you know? if it wasn't for the cops, she'd be dead. <laughs> That's right. But was it for them cops yeah. protecting these women, they they, they wouldn't be running their mouth all like of, that. All of them. Every last one of these yeah. women, if it wasn't for the police, these women wouldn't be saying shit. Okay, if a woman, she, if there was no police, uh, an adulterous woman would get put to death for committing adultery. Because that's, that's in a man's spirit. If, when someone has sex with your woman and steals your woman from you, it's a natural instinct to want to kill both of them. You know what I mean? But in America, say that that's illegal and you get locked up for that. But in the Bible, it says the adulterer and the adulteress shall surely be put to death. So the, the cops is the only thing that's saving these women. And you know the funny thing is, the only reason why those niggas are speaking up because them bitches was there, they was trying to think they were gonna get over. Yep, they think they gonna get some. Thinking they gonna get some. Bitch ain't give a fuck about that. Oh, nigga. And then she claimed. wisdom, I mean. And that woman, she claimed to be a Muslim, wearing pants, ain't got her head covered. Uh, what else? She, she called us homophobes, which means she accepts a homosexual. False witnesses. False witnesses. She accepts, it's bearing false witness. She accepts homosexuals. Wearing tight pants, but she's a Muslim. If the Muslims would have chopped their head off dressed like that. The Muslims don't play that. If a woman dressed like she was dressed in a Muslim country, then she gets stoned to death. You know what I mean? Get the fuck out of here. Right. For he knew that for envy they had delivered him. When he sat up, when he was set down on the judgment seat, his wife sent unto him, saying, Have thou nothing to do with that just man? Or has suffered many things today, this day, in a dream because of him? And the chief priests and the elders persuaded the multitude that they should ask the robbers and destroy Yahweh Shah. The governor answered and said unto them, Whether of a twine will ye that I release unto you? They said, Barabbas. Pilate said unto them, What shall I do then with Yahweh Shah, which is called Mahashiach? They all say unto him, Let him be crucified. And the governor said, Why? What evil hath he done? But they cried out, the more and more, saying, let him be crucified, like the scripture you said. Have I become your enemy because I tell you the truth? 
And that's all Yahweh Shai was doing is, you know, telling these people the truth, man. And we kept, and we kept asking, well, what, what do we say that's wrong? Give me one example. Nothing. They ain't have you none. You can't get one example of anything oh, that we said was false. how we speak. Oh. But they going off on that. Why? Because <laughs> we're grown men and we speak. We got bass in our voices. Right, 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 right. And we're grown people. We're not children. Right. They said, let him be crucified. When Pilate saw that he could reveal nothing, but that rather a tumult was made, he took it. was probably going crazy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It was like tripping, man. It's like throwing shit. You know when Jay get pissed off, they riot and throw shit. They throwing. You know they were so pissed on him. Throwing shit at him. A tumult was made. He took water and washed his hands before the multitude, saying, I am innocent of the blood of this just person. You think about it too, for a lot of uh, uh, Jakes, when they crucified the Lord, that was like a, a show to them, like a good time. They get to go to the show, watch somebody be crucified, like laugh at him, you know what I mean? Like, like a pay-per-view thing. Yeah, but like a pay yeah, exactly. That was their Conor uh, McGregor fight for yeah, Mayweather. Yeah, yeah. Saying, I am innocent of the blood of this just man. See ye to it. Then answered all the people, Israelites. Then answered all the people who said, his blood be for us and for our children. That was the children. That was the children. Israel's some evil people, man. Some evil, evil people, man. Some old man.